A length of wire has a resistance of 6 ohms. The resistance of wire of same material 3 times as long as twice the cross-sectional area will be Option A 36 ohms, Option B 9 ohms, Option C 1 ohm and Option D 5 ohms. Let us read the data carefully and highlight that length has become 3 times and area has been increased by let us write down the data first. We have given R is equals to 6 ohms, which is the resistance of wire. And new length is 3 times the original length and new area is 2 times the original area. How do we solve it? We know that equation of the resistance is equals to rho L over A. This is the general equation. Just put the value of just put the value of resistance and equation becomes 6 is equals to rho L over A. Now write the resistance equation for the new length. So R dash becomes rho L dash over A dash. We need to calculate R dash between the value of L dash which is 3L and a value of A dash is 2A. So R dash becomes we take 3 by 2 outside and we are left with the row L over A. From original resistance we obtain the value of row L over A. Put it in the equation right now. Then the new resistance becomes 3 by 2. Value of rho by L by A is 6. So we obtain new resistance as 9 ohms. So this is the answer to the question. And from the answers we can see it is option B. As you know in the exams we don't have much time to solve a numerical properly step by step. So here I am giving you a trick on how to solve it quickly. So our new resistance will be equals to your new length divided by new area into the original resistance. Just put in the values. In our previous question we saw that new L was 3 times the original length and area was 2 times. So just divide 3 by 2 into the original resistance. Our original resistance was 6 ohms so it can be anything. So you see here you obtain here answer 9 ohms as solve it a theoretical method. So this is an easy way to solve it quickly. Now let's take another example and solve it through the trick. Our new length is now half the original length and area is 1 by 3 the original area. Now let's solve it through the trick. Just write 1 by 2 over 1 by 3 into 6. So this becomes 3 by 2 into 6. You have come up with the answer now. So the new resistance here is also 9 ohms because we have decreased both the factors in the same dimension as we increased earlier. Thank you very much for staying with us till now. Please drop a comment which method you find is the best to solve such type of questions.